Hello everyone, welcome back to a new Aviation Jack video. Hope you're doing it really, really well. So today I'm going to be showing you how to calibrate the throttle in the Innibuilds Abus A350. So as you can see down here currently, my throttle is at the D10 of climb, even though I have my Thrustmaster um, quadrant set to idle zone. So anyway, we need to show you how to and how to get everything calibrated. So once you have switched on the aircraft by turning on the external power and the batteries, you want to come to your EFB over in the uh, left hand screen. And then on the EFB you have an option called options. In the options part you want to go down to throttle calibration. And as you can see you're given this screen with some lovely different colours here of uh, axis 1 and axis 2. Axis 1 is the left and axis 2 is the right hand side one. First of all, we'll go through these settings. So, reverser on axis. Well, for the quadrant that we have, the Thrustmaster ones, yes, we do have reversers on this quadrant. Use global dead zone. I don't even know what that is, so for now, I'll keep it on no and see if we need to deal with that. Um, so, essentially, what you want to do is, is just set things where they are. So, if we now set my detent all the way down to max reverse, as you can see, it's set to like idle. Uh, max reverse. There we go. So, now that is set. Now what I want to do is set my throttles to idle reverse and then simply click idle reverse and now that's been set and now my throttles are currently at the uh, idle position without me touching them and I'm going to click idle and now idle is set. Push it up to climb, click climb and then push it up to flex, click the flex button and then up to toga click toga and now that should be completely calibrated if we go to the throttles we can have a look to see if that is the case there we go so my throttles are now at the idle position and as you can see they are at idle if I now set reverse thrust as you can see the reverses have come up and now back to idle again I'm gonna set climb thrust there we go set flex and set toga and as you can see, it's not gone into Toga, but I'm not sure if there is... Obviously, it does obviously now work and calibrate it. There might just be a 350 thing where it doesn't go into Toga unless... I don't know, should fly in maybe? Okay, everyone, so there we have it. Now we have our throttles fully calibrated and working complete. Thank you all for watching this video. If it did help you out, please leave a like and also come back for more A350 videos. We're going to do the full flight very shortly from Toulouse up to Copenhagen amongst all these other 350s here. So yeah, thank you for watching and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.